If you're looking for a winner for a love Looking for a tent Looking for some so today we're gonna learn how to make wine slushies. So these are the ingredients that you're gonna need today. Um, preferably use a sweet wine so that makes it easier on you. I'm not good with measurements, but for this video I did. So you're gonna put, you're gonna use a, about two cups of ice from your refrigerator that I use since I have an ice machine in there. I use this Liberty Creek wine that was like $7.50 for my local Walmart and it's really good so I encourage you to go ahead and buy that you're gonna buy these great value ones I mean you could be bougie or whatever and get you some name brand ones but I use a great value uh, brand of strawberries and I used about a cup of those which is like half of the bag and I poured those in there they were like two dollars and fourteen cents for this little bag um, next we're gonna get some sugar right right no nope. oh we're gonna put some more wine in there wait wait i was wrong we about to go to the sugar y'all sorry so you're gonna use one fourth cup of sugar i mean add as much as you want to it you know taste it and see if you want to add some more but typically this is about how much i use again i typically don't use measurements but for y'all i just kind of i you know i tried to be a little a little professional so you're going to get that one cup of sugar, I mean, one-fourth cup of sugar. You're going to pour some more wine in it to make it kind of even out. You know what I'm saying? You Yeah, you got to you gotta add a little more. So, right here, you're going to put the top on it. I have a Ninja Blender that my man bought for me a while ago, a couple months ago, and it works great. But you got to turn it on. You're going to let it blend for like 30 seconds because it don't take that long, baby. So... Uh, as you see, it's blending, 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 and stop. Um, you'll see me taste testing it because it was good, and I even reached in the second time. But y'all, y'all gonna see it, y'all gonna see it, and it was good. I could stop digging in it, but just taste test it again. If you have to add more sugar or whatever, do that, do that. So, here, um, this is for the people who want to make it all cute and stuff. So, you're gonna put or you're gonna cut some lemons up and put it on the side, like when you go to the little fancy ass restaurants. So you're gonna put that little lemon on there, you're gonna cut it, gotta make a slit in it or whatever. And here's for the people who wanna make it look real pretty again. You're gonna put that lemon for the people who want the sugar around the rim. You're gonna put that lemon around the rim and then you're gonna get like a plastic plate and put some, just like some sugar on the plate and then you'll see what I'm, what I'm about to do. For all the people who wanna be perfectionists and stuff like me. So yeah, you're gonna do that. And there it go. There you go, swirl around that little plate. Boom, there you go, there you go. So, now you're gonna pour your wine slushy into the cup and that's pretty much it. Um, you'll see later that I added some lemon or my boyfriend added some lemon to it because he just, he like to do his own thing sometimes. But you go put that lemon on top of the cup, make it look real, real cute, you know what I'm saying? And here you go, that is your wine. I'm in my yak, I wanna dance. I'm on that yak, I wanna dance. Come get your man before I put him in a trance. I'm in my yak, I'm on that yak, I wanna dance.